Well, on a normal film, you would, um, you know, you'd bring in some uh, background, like voice performance, to fill in voices for everybody that you see in the background. Because obviously, when you're shooting, if everyone's talking in the background, you're not going to have continuity. It's going to mask the the dialogue of the of the main characters and that sort of thing. Um, and normally, actors would come into the studio, they'd watch the picture, and they'd just kind of um, you know, match their words to the action they're seeing on screen. In this particular case, we, did, um, we didn't show the actors any picture. We didn't give them any context. We didn't, show, we didn't tell them anything about the story. And um, we did an eight-hour session that I had carefully scripted out with everything that I had wanted to achieve in this eight-hour session. And Darren, who likes to come to all of his all of his ADR sessions, including Loop Group, decided to not look at anything I'd scripted and just did eight hours of wild Loop Group recording. And he would just direct people to say, hey, say this word, say this word, now say this, now say that. I had no idea what was going on. And then we ended up doing you know, a temp mix and he'd be like, why isn't that person saying that word that I told him? I know we said it. I'm like, oh, I see how this is going to go now. <laughs> so it became a very interesting um, process in the, with this particular film that ended up being extremely rewarding in the end. But um, it, it was a, it was probably the most daunting thing to get through on this film um, because there was so much. Like, every time you heard someone say something, and whatever speaker again was completely intentional and wanting wanting to be heard from the get go, although I didn't I didn't learn that until <laughs> you know a couple months into it, and I'm like, oh, um, that's where that line's supposed to go. Uh, yeah.